Uh, hi everybody, it's me, Sailor Mini Moon. And today, well, the shout out videos are gonna probably make start making those tomorrow. Anyway, today I'm gonna talk about how come some people on YouTube make get a lot of views and others get a small percent of the views and some don't get no views at all. Now Many people have many theories to how this happens or why it doesn't happen. Now, the first theory that some people come up with is, oh, well, partners and YouTubers who get a lot of views have to do things like fake thumbnails and misleading titles and misleading tags. Now, if everybody, if that was how every, if that was how you got if that was how all the partners and all the youtubers who got a lot of views did that then that would be violating youtube community guidelines that would be spamming a website okay now i know there are some people on youtube who do use fake thumbnails and misleading titles and tags to get people to accidentally you know click on their video and then find out that it was not that the thumbnail title description and tags was not you know misle misrepresented the video and there are people who don't do it now some people have theories that oh the people who get a lot of views on YouTube know people um I don't really know if there's anything to back up that theory but People think, oh, the partners and the YouTubers who get a lot of views on their videos, they know someone. Oh, they know people. No, I don't really think so. Because when I when we came on YouTube, we didn't know anyone. Didn't know any of our cyber acquaintances by name or whatever. Didn't know anybody. Okay? Now, there are people out there who would figure... Um, some people think, oh, autoplaying. Well, that only works if you haven't subscribed to the channel. Once you subscribe to the channel, the autoplaying no longer works anymore unless you unsubscribe to the channel and then the autoplaying goes into effect again. Um, but everybody's got these theories, you know. They're going to say the reason that some people on YouTube only get a small portion of views because they're not, because their videos aren't entertaining and they're not making videos that people don't want to see. Okay, according to that theory, I'm supposed to go around and ask all my subscribers what they want to see. I'm supposed to make videos that they want to see and not videos that I want to make. Okay, does that make any sense? Now I could now that I don't work that way. I make a video and if some people on YouTube enjoy it, well good. I don't sit there and make videos for I don't sit there and make videos thinking, well, oh I'm making this video because that's what they want to see and not what I want to make. It makes no sense. You know. Next they'll say well, you need to use transformations and special effects in the intro and outro and editing to get more views. That may or may not work, okay? Just because somebody happens to go out crazy with ArcSoft or Microsoft Windows Movie Maker or Apple's Macintosh iMovie or CyberLink or Final Cut or whatever the case is, MacCam, just because they go all, all crazy with those programs does not mean they're going to get a lot of views for their videos. So that theory just panned out right there. Other people think, oh, that YouTube controls who gets the views and who doesn't. That they sit there and in, in, in their cubicles and they push a button on, a com on one of their computers saying, okay, we only want the partners and some YouTubers to get views. Oh, and these are the partners and YouTubers we don't want to get views, like they control it or something. You know, 
like it's some type of conspiracy and the people at YouTube control who gets more views. I hardly doubt that YouTube has, I hardly doubt that YouTube actually, the people at YouTube actually control the viewership of partner channels and the viewership of the non-partner channels, okay? For example, the views I get on my video, those are the views I'm getting. There's nobody at YouTube sitting there and saying, well, Okay, you're not a partner, so it's only going to give you five or ten views for this vid. No, I don't think so. Um, then you're going to have people who claim, oh, it's your title, it's your address, it's your web camera quarter, camera quarter. Oh, it's your location of origin, it's your computer, the computer's operating system, your internet provider. You know, they're going to claim... Oh, it's what you say and what you do. Oh, they're going to claim all this stuff, and none of it's going to play a role whatsoever. The point is, I really don't know why that there are partners and YouTubers out there who get more views, and then there are partners and YouTubers out there who don't get a lot of views. I don't know why. I don't know why there's a, there's a, there's a division between the YouTubers out there. I don't know why there is when it comes to viewership. So that's about it. I'm sorry, I don't really know the answer. Okay. I don't know why that my videos only get a small portion of views and went, say, for example, Cindric 2015 might get more views than me. And I don't know why. I have no control over it. To tell you the truth, I'm very happy with my viewership on my channel. I'm Salem Mini Moon Reading. Hope you enjoyed this video.